Hi, I just wanted to explain how to do the wrap and turn stitch, which is um, a feature of the Guernsey Cardi Coat. So this is just a little sample and I'm working up part of the row in moss stitch, counting as I go. And then when I get to the required number of stitches, which was 35 to there, this is then the wrapped stitch. So I'll show you how to do it. So we'll moss, because I've done two more rows since then, we'll moss 25. A moss stitch, as you know, is knit one, purl one. So two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 25 so I've worked 25 and the next stitch is the one to be wrapped now that would be a purl stitch if I'm following the moss so I'll take it onto the right hand needle wrap the yarn around and move it back onto the left so I've got 25 here and that one has been wrapped and then turn my work there's your wrap stitch now on the right hand needle and I'm going to be taking the yarn behind ready to moss stitch back down again. So I'll show you how to do it when the next stitch is going to be a purl stitch. So work back down the row to the bottom edge. If you wrap the stitch rather than just stopping and turning your work, it means you don't get a little hole um, and it makes the insert pattern work better. Okay, so 20 stitches now. So the next stitch should actually be a knit, a knit stitch if we were working <clears throat> in moss stitch. So leave the yarn behind, slip it across, wrap, and then take it back again. Turn your work, and that wrap stitch there is on the right hand needle. This is going to be a purl stitch now. And so back down we go. So that's when you're decreasing the number of wrapped stitches. And on the next row I'll show you how you are then counting back up again. So we'll do 25. We did 20 on the last wrap and turn and we'll do 25 this time. Okay. <clears throat> Here we go.
18, 19, 20. So that's where we were last time. There's the wrapped stitch, but you just work it like normal. So 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. <clears throat> so we've done 25, that's the stitch to be wrapped. Like that, turn your work around, slide it back and back down again. I hope that makes sense. And if I can help at all, let me know. Drop me an email. Gorgeousyarns at gmail.com. Bye for now.